I that see. is called the Grand Hyatt. Oh, Grand Hyatt is going to be yeah. in that building? I see. Yeah. And there, this place is known as the Bund. The Bund is about 1.5 kilometers long. The road here that is called the Zhongshan Road is to one. Named and the these buildings, they were all built in 1920s to 1930s, were not built at the same time and were not designed by the same architect. But they have the same characteristic. They are the most popular style during that period. I see. And now the, the old Manjay's band, a very famous band, will perform at the Peace Hotel. Uh, the famous shopping street in Shanghai that is called the Road, is served by the Peace Hotel. Was it? Shanghai Town, that means that uh, that's another name to show the location of Shanghai. I see. It used to be a very small village. <laughs> The cells are over, exhausting. That's fine. Okay, so you you use it a lot? I use it a lot, so I have to buy another couple of cells. So can this one take? Yeah, this can take. Yeah, this can. Yeah, you can take on this. You know how to take this, right? To move another one, right? Why was the bridge destroyed during the Cultural Revolution? Oh, okay. Some red soldiers of the Chen Mao, some followers, oh, I see. and uh, they destroy some cultures like the temple, like the garden. Oh, religion. Anything, anything that is uh, religious importance, they have. Yeah. Oh, I see. That is the most famous restaurant in this place. Oh, really? That is the Green Wave Restaurant. Mm. And this is for snack, so you can find some very delicious food. I can smell it. <laughs> yep. The most famous one I will introduce to you, that is the beans. So this is the flakes. I this see. kind of thin stuff, the beans. I see. Very delicious, the pork inside and some soup. Mm. And here you can see the long line. People have to wait at the one hour. Oh, I see. <laughs> Yeah, these are the, the what kind of fish was this? This is the carp and there's some carp. Oh, I see. Because the new year coming and so this is the newly built decoration. The red is the major color for good luck. Used to be the part of the Yuan Garden. Yuan Garden much bigger than now. But after reconstruction it becomes smaller. And 
where nobody could go there now. Hmm. So the, it's not allowed. I mean, nobody can enter that yeah. area. Okay. The door is closed. I see. And there, this big rock rig was piled with 2,000 tons of rocks. Mm. And on the top, you can see a small pavilion. Right. And uh, 400 years ago, it is the highest point in Shanghai, you know? Oh, I see. 12 meters in height. If oh. you stand inside, you can see the Huangpu River in the distance. That was the highest point in uh, Shanghai once upon a time. But now Before it's all the big buildings came. Yeah. So from here, we can see the four major... Because the famous poet, and his name that is called the Lin Hejin, and he lived in the solitary mountain in Hangzhou, and he liked the plum and the cream. He, uh, he used the plum just like his wife, the cream just like his son, mm. to spend all his life. I see. Because he's not so um, he's not so accepted by the emperor, mm -hmm. so he feel very disappointed. Yeah. Okay, let's go on please. And here we can see two Chinese lions. Yeah, guarding. Nearly about 700 years old. <laughs> so, more money, you can do more things. More things, yeah. I think it's a question of uh, safety and, uh, you know, mm -hmm. um, the risk perception, the perception of uh, risk and perception of uh, threat. This is so big. Mm -hmm. I, I you know, 400 years ago, Mr. Pan Yun Duan's father, he planted two ginkgo trees here, one male and one female. This one is the male one, because the female one unfortunately died, so the magnolia tree was planted at its site. I see. Yeah. And uh, this one is But this is still alive, right? I'm still alive, of course. Oh, yeah. Known as the living fossil because it grows so slowly. Yeah. So in Chinese we call it Hongsun tree because the uh, grandfather uh, planted the tree, the grandson got the fruit. I see. The grandfather in Chinese that means from the grandson in Chinese that means mm. Mm. We see the <laughs> this is the sum of the Dragon King, and so it has the power to control the rain. Put it on. Oh, 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 and the best location that is the, to face the south direction. So here you can get cool in summer and get warm in winter. Hmm. And th that is also a part of the same complex for the same garden? That same built? garden, yes. So they're all really Ming Dynasty furniture, what we see here, is it? Yeah. Mm. This is their only building. It has some Ming Dynasty <laughs>
这个This whole boat is uh, made of jade, a green jade, weighing about uh, 75 tons. This whole boat was uh, carved in stone. The bottom portion is made in marble. I have seen smaller ones, but not such a big oyster. <laughs> smaller one? We have yeah. a Oh, okay. Yeah, that, that size I have seen, yes. Uh, where do you see it? I saw it in, um, in uh, some marine exhibitions in, uh, I think, San Francisco or somewhere. So this is how the actual animal looks like, is it? This is a seeker oyster. Mm. And the big one is a freshwater oyster. That's the freshwater, yeah. okay. So you have seen the oyster. Do you know how many pearls in, in this oyster? No. No, you don't know? I don't know. <laughs> okay, maybe you can take a guess. Can you? How many pearls you guess on this oyster? Do you think it really has some pearls inside? Yes, because this is the culture. Cultural press. Oh, the culture, okay. So, DSUP have one pair or two press inside. Oh my Let's god. Yeah, just one. Oh, you have one, oh, okay. Yes. So, because this oyster is from the sea, one sea per oyster just produce one pair, and the freshwater press oyster, they have the high quantity of the press. I see. At least 10 pairs in one oyster. Here you can see. And also we can find the pearls, they are in different shape. And the pearl beside the oyster, they are flattened shape and also we have the oval shape like this. Oh, I see, yeah. yeah. I can see a lot and of them. the color yeah. is a little different. This is the white color. Brown, yeah. So in this oyster, we still can find the different colors. Like right. This one is the pink colors and something a little uh, darker is the purple colors. Oh. So if uh, you have the experience to buy the press, you can see other colors like the black, golden and the gray colors. But you know why the press have so many colors? Why? What? Okay, that's Maybe because so that women love them. <laughs> if you have too many colors, so that you know people buy them. So that the, the husbands will buy for the wives. <laughs> so the, the pearls know that, you know. It depends on the oyster in the different mineral. They will absorb the different trace elements. So the pearls will take oh, different I see. colors. Because of the trace elements, okay. Yeah. So if the oyster will absorb more iron trace elements, the pearls color will be dark, such as the black and the purple. So if the oyster absorb more copper trace elements, the pearls color will be pink and golden. So I see. Uh, we know that for all the colors, 70% of the pearls color are white and the white color are very common and only 5% of all the color are black and golden so these two types of the color are very rare also more expensive mm. so in terms of the prices we divide the price into three types and this one is the first distribution that we work mm. we have produced in Malaysia, Australia, Australia we call the rest of the curve and we have produced in Japan we call this curve we have produced in this place we 
Well, the thing is, you know, many, many things, the jewelry which I buy, my wife doesn't like for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> but anyway, thanks for showing me the pearls. You can look. Oh, I see. This is the five star hotel. Mm. To the right hand, we can see another white building, the roof just like the flowers. 
Right. That is the urban planning exhibition board. Mm. So they are the together with the Zhanghan Museum, they are the four very famous buildings mm. in the People's Square. I see. And also to that direction you can see the building with the brand of Samsung. Mm. And there, that is the very famous department store at the beginning of the Nanjing Road pedestrian walkway. Oh, I see. So this is the main people square you, where you can see the real downtown of Shanghai, is it? Uh, yes, downtown. This is the center. This is the center of downtown, okay. 